A dedicated group of walkers are resting in Milford. They're in the home stretch of a walk from Boston to Lower Manhattan to arrive for the 20th anniversary of 9-11 on Saturday. News 12 Connecticut Suzanne Goldklang met up with them in Milford and she joins us now with the very latest on this story. Suzanne. This is night 10 for this tough group of walkers. They wrapped up the afternoon here at Dotside Brewery and are determined to get to ground zero by Saturday morning, September 11th. They say everywhere they go, they encounter encouragement. Come on, move it. A flag shimmering in the sun, a fire truck's flashing lights. <laughs> step by step. We have angels following us. The goal gets closer. You're afraid you won't finish, uh, you'll disappoint people. Danny, Ezra, and Denise. We're walking from Boston International to New York City for 9-11. Thank you. The soldier, the student, the widow. I know my husband's entire firehouse is rooting for me, and um, I just I just can't wait to fall into their arms. On the road, 10 days. It kind of felt like the country was falling apart right before we left. The pain of blisters soothed by the balm of support. This is beautiful to see them, you know, still keep in mind what we went through. And just the people who honk the horns and gives us a thumbs up. Uh, it's been amazing. The moments of unity. We never should forget. The ultimate tribute. The divisiveness, you feel like that's what's happening. But as we were walking through all of these neighborhoods, it's not like that at all. I'm wishing them well, that they, you know, have a safe journey and that everybody cheers them on. And the Heroes Hike will start back up right here at 7 a.m. People are welcome to come and join the group and walk as far as they want. In Milford, Suzanne Goldklang, News 12 Connecticut. Absolutely. Join them if you can. Thank you.